Hi there, this is Ranjit and we'll be doing the unboxing of this USB 3 card reader and also I'll be testing the same and if you can see this is a product by Transin and it's a USB 3 based uh, card reader and it can read multiple cards, SD card, micro SD card, CF cards etc and let me just open the same and as you can see the MRP pricing here quoted here is uh, 1050 rupees but I got it uh, from my local dealer for rupees 1000 and let me open it up and as you can see this comes up and if you notice the cable as this is a USB 3 cable we have this in broker and this is the proprietary end and let us take out this one also let me take this out I hate these packaging and this is out and as you can see the pamphlet again it does not specify the read speeds that we can get I'm hoping that I'll be getting some better read speeds and again some more catalog and product info by some other products advertisement and uh, again transcend uh, card re again memory cards and etc advertisement so let me keep this to the side and this gives the actual product info again it does not specify the speeds that we might attain so we'll test it out and this is the product itself let me zoom in it's pretty small and as you can see it says transient and it says usb 3 and again your sd cards sdhc cards will go here if you have a micro sd card we have a slot for that also and if you're using the compact flash memory card it can use that also and on this end we have sony proprietary cards that's the ms duo cards and this will plug in here and this will plug it into a usb 3 based computer and let me do that and we'll test it with my sony card which is supposed to be a very fast card and let's see if we can get some good read speeds and the reason why i got this uh, card reader is that uh, to transfer hd footage from my camera to the computer as most of these camcorders and even this camera that i'm using just use the usb 2 interface it's pretty slow it's transferring just at around 18 to 20 mb per second and uh, all these footage are in hd and sometimes it can take up to 15 to 20 minutes to transfer the video files to my computer and we're going to use this card uh, we have done some footage and as you can see let me zoom in a little bit this is a pretty fast card actually a class 10 card and as you can see it says that it can transfer speeds up to 94 mb per second so let's use the new card reader and see what speeds we can attain with this one so this is my computer and i've attached the transcend usb uh, 3 card reader and let's just go to my computer and as you can see actually these three drives were populated via that automatically and actually i've inserted that sony uh, sdhc card in this that's the h drive so let's look at it Let's go to the files that we have and they'll be in streams. And so as you can see, these are the video files and we'll transfer this one to my computer. Again, do note that my computer is running a SSD drive, so there won't be any slowdown of speed so we can accurately judge the speeds. So let's move this one. Uh, this is a big file that's uh, 862 meg approximately. And uh, with the USB 2 interface of my camcorder, I used to just able to transfer it at the speed of around 16 to 18, 19 MB per second. So it used to take a lot of time. So let's see how fast we can do with this USB 3 card reader. And we're just going to move this file to the desktop. And as you can see, it's displaying the speed over here as it's Windows 8. And uh, it's transferring at around 83 MB per second. So significantly faster and already the file has been copied. So you can say that it's approximately about uh, four and a half times faster than the USB 2 interface speeds that were I was getting. So yes, it works, it's faster but it's not very fast like again it will depend upon the card the card that we had the sony card it said uh, on the pamphlet that it supports speeds up to 92 mb per second but we got 84 mb per second with this card reader so again if you transfer a lot of files uh, to and fro from your computer using memory cards this card reader might make sense thank you for watching this video this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video